What is good, guys? Um, I am going to be doing top five ARs and top five SMGs. We're gonna go with AR first. So for the fourth, for um, uh, why I say fourth? For the fifth AR, we have the Holger 556. And for the meta build for the Holger 556, you're gonna want the Cassis Break for your muzzle, the Jack Glassless Optic, and if you don't want to run an optic, then throw on high grains and switch that up, or, or take off the optic and run high grains. Then the 40 round mag. Through and heavy support grip, all, or you could take that off and throw in high grain rounds. Then the Cryo 6 Mesh Barrel, that's the build that I run personally. Then for the number four spot for the ARs, it's going to be the MCW. Not with the conversion kit, because this is supposed to be an AR type deal build, not SMV. I like throwing Jack Glassless Optic, Zemin Muzzle for that extra no recoil touch, 40 round mag. You can throw on the 60 if you're playing quads. But if you need 60 rounds to kill people in solos, seek help. Um, the Bruin Heavy Support Grip, or actually not the Bruin Heavy Support Grip, the 16.5 Cyclone Long Barrel, and then High Grain Rounds. Because the TKK on the MCW is good, but that just helps it a lot more. Now for the number 3 spot. The number 3 AR, it came down to a few. But I chose... The MTZ 556 in the meta build for the MTZ 556, in my opinion, what I would be running is the Cassis Break, the MTZ Drifter Heavy Long Barrel, Bruin Heavy Sport Grip, 50 Round Drum, and e, an EXF. That didn't happen. A, um, close Quarters Assault Stock. And if you don't want to run, if you don't like the iron sights, you can throw on an optic, or you could take off the stock and put on high grain rounds. But that's what I like to run. And then for the meta number two AR, I like the SVA 545 in burst mode. For our optic, we're going to throw on the Jack Glassless optic. Nova, whatever you're doing, you better go lay down. It's my dog. She likes to eat things, so I have to yell at her sometimes. The Bruin Heavy Support Grip, the 60 round mag, and then the uh, VT7 Spirit Fire Suppressor. I run that over the Sonic Suppressor. And then I would like to throw on the STV Precision Barrel. That's the SVA build. Number one is kind of a no brainer for the ARs. It's not an AR though, but it runs as an AR. The Holder 26 which is the new absolute meta right now. Um, Cassis Break, I like to run, but you could run the VT7 Spirit Fire Suppressor. Bruin Heavy Support Grip, I don't run an optic on this. I see a lot of people do, but I don't. I run the Axon Lord Stock, then the Holder Factory Barrel, and then for my last attachment, I like to throw on the high grain rounds. And that's my Holger 26 build. You can run an optic and take off the stock. Or the grip. It depend, or the underbarrel, I meant. It depends. That's our number one. For, but for the SMGs, for the fifth SMG, for the fifth SMG, I include the WSP Swarm. This gun is actually pretty underrated. I used it in some solo trios, and I actually dropped, like, I think 25 kills and a win. Um, so for this build, I like to throw on the 50 mag. I don't throw on the 100 round drum. Then I throw on the FSS Rampage V2 Tactical Stock. Um, pretty broken attachment. Then I like to throw on the WSP Reckless 90 Long Barrel. Zemin 35 Compensated Flat Hider. Then the XRK Edge BW4 Hand Spout. And then for the fourth SMG, I thought I'd throw in the WSP9 because it's still really good. So for my meta WSP9 build, we're going to throw on the WSP factory stock, the 50 round mag, DR6 hand stop, Zemin 35 compensated flash hider, then the reckless 90 long barrel, the WSP reckless 90 long barrel. Number three is pretty much a no-brainer here. I like to run the Rival 9 at my number three because I think that the the gun that's gonna be at number two, I could have put at number three, but I think it's really good for the number two. Or the, wait, I just did this completely wrong. Hold up, hold up. 
Oh, wait. No, number three is right. The striker at number three is correct, not the rival. Okay, I, I, I just did that completely wrong. My bad. Okay, so the striker with the Zen 35 Compensate Flash Hider, 48 round mag, uh, DR6 hand stop, and the, uh, what's it called here? The barrel would be the striker recon long barrel. Then, my favorite, um, one, my favorite, uh, stock to use is the Lachlan Recon Series stock, because it gives it literally no recoil. Then number two, I kind of forgot about this SMG for some reason, and that SMG is going to be the FJX Horus. And for the FJX Horus, you could run it with the conversion kit, so I'm going to give you two builds. I'm going to give you the regular build right here, which is going to be the Sync 9 Long Barrel. You could run the Martis Heavy, but I like the Sync 9 Long Barrel. Um, I like the Thrawn, the 48 round mag, the 60 mag takes away too much uh, movement speed, the modest 30 stock, Zemin muzzle, and then for our last attachment, I would throw on the DR6 hand stop under barrel, but we're going to throw on the low 9M grip, but if you want a conversion kit build, I will get you that, so you're obviously going to throw on the Jack Scatmar kit for the under barrel, I like this is an AR build. I like the Brood Heavy support grip. Sadly, the Jack BFB, that just gives it no recoil. I'm telling you, just none. Jack Glassless Optic, the, the low 9M grip. That's that AR build if you want to be more at long range. If you want to have that no recoil touch, but still be able to move, throw on the no stock mod, the DR6 hand stop, this here, you're still going to run the Jack BFB, but trust, you're still going to have a lot of movement. Then, you could throw on a rear grip, and if you were to throw on a rear grip, I would throw on, personally, the um, Pock S Tack Grip. But you could, but um, if you don't like the iron size, throw on the Jack Glassless Optic. But, I know some people hate the Jack BFB, so you could throw on the Sonic Suppressor, or the... Um, Zen 35, it's up to you, but I love running the Jack BFB on this because I just feel like it gives it no recoil. Then for the number one option for the SMGs, obviously the Superior 46. My favorite build is Rescue 9 stock, 40 round mag, DR6 hand stop, Zen 35 compensated flash iron, and Zulu Opt 3 light barrel. That's my meta build. Hope you enjoyed. Deuces. I don't even know what that means. <laughs>